The fall season is upon us and the November issue is here. My selections are all original articles from the oculoplastic and facial surgery sections, both with commentaries and two from the breast surgery section, one with a commentary. Don't miss this month's podcast series from the cosmetic medicine section, safety, pharmacodynamic response, and treatment satisfaction with Onato botulinum toxin A, 40 units, 60 units, and 80 units in subjects with moderate to severe dynamic glabella lines. I also invite you to listen to the monthly ASJ Open Forum podcast. Let's discuss this month's selections from the oculoplastic sections. Do prostaglandin analog lash lengtheners cause eyelid fat and volume loss? These are becoming very popular in enlarging the lashes and this international uh, article looks at whether the treatment to enlarge the lashes causes any atrophy of the fat around the eyelids. There's also an excellent commentary by Dr. Ted Wonio. Supplatismal procedures are gaining in popularity and from the facial surgery section I have chosen the article age-related changes of the submandibular gland is it hypertrophy is it ptosis with age the authors look at the changes and increase in volume of the submandibular gland with age there's an excellent commentary by Dr. Francisco Bravo from Spain who takes a different look and adds his own insights on the uh, enlargement or at least visibility of the submandibular gland. From the breast surgery section, another paper on BIA, ALCL, an international perspective on where we currently stand with this unusual complication of textured breast implants. It's an original contribution from Italy. Dr. Santanelli is the lead author and they present the third world consensus conference on BIA ALCL. Again, emphasizing that it's uncommon, probably underrelated, and that we're making some progress in understanding the underlying etiology. Also from the breast section, a novel approach to treating the uh, tubular breast by Dr. Aboud from Belgium with a commentary by Dr. Conron Kubahi from New Orleans in the United States. This is a novel approach with fat grafting and loops to correct the uh, deformity. That's it for November. Look forward to seeing you in uh, December with our December choices for the last edition of ASJ in 2022.